friends, so today I am back with Naveen, Nevin, and we're going to be making another installment of Baking with Breast Friends, and we're very excited about it. We have another helper in the kitchen today as well. Breast Friends 2.0. Well, actually this is 3.0 because I made one on just oh, like yeah. that back in the day. Uh, that was in like December, I think, but that was a great time. But today we're gonna be kind of baking, kind of not, because we're not actually gonna use an oven, so you don't need any kind of device but you probably need a mixer. Okay, let's just get the recipe and see what we need. Um, so today we are making Oreo balls because those are just the greatest treat in the whole entire world, right? They're so good. I've they only had them once. School. The things you're going to need are a 16 ounce package of Oreo cookies crushed, an eight ounce package of cream cheese softened, and a 24 ounce package of dark chocolate. Using a blender or hand mixer, mix the Oreos and cream cheese together. This is the device we're gonna be using today. Destroy them. <laughs> it's working. Meanwhile, you can let out all of your <laughs> held up <laughs> angers. Fuck you, Susan! Yes. This looks pretty good. I just realized that we're ogres and we're disgusting and never washed our hands. I did. You did? Yeah. Oh, it was just me. Now we're gonna take out this little guy. It's literally like a lard. Like a lump of lard. Yeah. Take it to town. Oh my god, it just caught my eye. She's ready. Now you're gonna roll them into walnut-sized balls. Slap that thing on there. I feel like we're definitely doing something wrong. This just doesn't feel right. You need a little more, honey. You know that commercial? No. Wash your hands, this shit gross. Now they have to chill, so put them in, you know, fridge or freezer, but we put them in the freezer because we have limited amount of time, folks. We are now melting and exterminating the goods. I don't know why I said exterminating because it's it's not going anywhere. This is a lot better way to melt chocolate, by the way, when you boil water and then put a saucepan on top because sometimes it burns if you put just the chocolate in a saucepan or put it in the microwave or something, so. Do this, kids. Okay, so we took them out of the freezer and realized that they're really not balls, so now we're forming them into balls because they're cooled. Now you're supposed to have some kind of a toothpick, but we don't have one of those, so we're just gonna kind of stab it like so, and then take her for a dip. Honestly, I'm doing this with my hands. Ow, it's hot! <laughs> Now put them things back in the freezer. If you bought six bars of chocolate like we did, you'll probably have a pretty hefty amount left over. So we decided while we're waiting for our balls to cool, we would um, eat some fruit as we answer some questions. So I said, tweet Nev and I questions to answer with the hashtag baking with breast. This blueberry looks like an old man wearing a comb over. Squirtle just knocked my camera over, so we're now filming on Lindsay's. Logan asks, which breast do you like better, your right or left? I like my left. I think my nipple is smaller on my left one, so my left one. Riley asks, what's one phrase or word you want to hear Snoop Dogg say to you? I love you, bitch. <laughs> I'm never gonna stop loving you. Bitch. bitch. <laughs> I'd want to hear him call me Lil Mama. Sandy asks, how long have you guys Sandy. been- Sandy. <laughs> how long have you guys been friends? Five years. <laughs> you touched my nipple. <laughs> Sarah Ann asks, how does Nevin Pepperman feel about Squirty? Well, right now, he's whining in his crate, yeah, that so... Boy. But how do you feel about him in general? I think they're in love. Yeah, I love Squirtle. Terrion Spears asks, Can you guys show us some of your smooth dance moves? about that action we pull up is about that when i came around i put it down on front line i did mine shay asks what is nevin going to college for i'm majoring in journalism and then she also had a second question that says meg why don't you drive in la because i can't afford a car right now shay lydia asked what would you do without your breasts sport around no bra for any occasion yeah i just I just wouldn't ever wear a bra. Silver asks, do you guys have a handshake? If not, can you make up a handshake right now? Go, go, go. Fuck. <laughs> My butt cheek is kind of steamy. Yeah, no. Like I really- I slap mine really hard. I slap that sucker on there really fast. <laughs> okay, on that note, we're gonna take our shits out of the shit. Okay, this is the finished product. I mean, the ball ones are like totally fine, but these ones look like they have a puddle sitting around them, but. You know, we'll live. This is the best thing I've ever made in my life. 
This is really good. Well, we would like to personally thank you for joining us today on our adventure. On another episode of Baking, Baking with, with Breast Friends. Friends. I'll link the other episodes down below so you can check those things out and just really have a great marathon and great time and great day in general. So we're gonna head out. I'll see you guys in my next video, okay? I'm glad Nevin was back for this. Oh my God, just thumbs up for her. Ta-ta, see you smiling. <laughs> Made a promise to my mama that I bless her with some grandkids. grandkids. She spoil them. But till then, I'm getting dollars. I'm just doing what I gotta. Can a man live? And it's all day. Oh, man.